Lord, I find myself at the beginning of another day. I do not know what it will bring. Please help me to be ready for whatever it may be. If I am to stand up, help me to stand bravely. If I am to sit still, help me to sit quietly. If I am to lie down, help me to do it patiently. If I am to do nothing, let me do it gallantly. I pray just for today, for these 24 hours, for the ability to cooperate with others according to the way Jesus taught us to live. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. May these words that he taught us become more than words. Please free my thinking and feelings and the thinking and feelings of others from all forms of self-will, self-centeredness, dishonesty and deception. Along with my brothers and sisters, I need this freedom to make my choices today according to your desires. Send your spirit to inspire me in time of doubt and indecision so that together we can walk along your path. Amen. If you have a prayer request, leave it down in the comments. I will be personally praying for all the prayer requests that you are posting in the comment section. May God bless you all. Psalm 38 Lord, do not rebuke me in your anger or discipline me in your wrath. Your arrows have pierced me and your hand has come down on me. Because of your wrath there is no health in my body. There is no soundness in my bones because of my sin. My guilt has overwhelmed me like a burden too heavy to bear. My wounds fester and are loathsome because of my sinful folly. I am bowed down and brought very low. All day long I go about mourning. My back is filled 
with searing pain. There is no health in my body. I am feeble and utterly crushed. I groan in anguish of heart. All my longings lie open before you, Lord. My sighing is not hidden from you. My heart pounds. My strength fails me. Even the light has gone from my eyes. My friends and companions avoid me because of my wounds. My neighbors stay far away. Those who want to kill me set their traps. Those who would harm me talk of my ruin. All day long they shim and lie. I am like the deaf who cannot hear, like the mute who cannot speak, I have become like one who does not hear, whose mouth can offer no reply. Lord, I wait for you. You will answer. Lord, my God, for I said, do not let them gloat or exalt themselves over me when my feet slip. For I am about to fall and my pain is ever with me. I confess my iniquity. I am troubled by sin. Many have become my enemies without a cause. Those who hate me without reason are numerous. Those who repay my good with evil lodge accusations against me. Though I seek only to do what is good. Lord, do not forsake me. Do not be far from me, my God. Come quickly to help me, my Lord and my Savior. Lord, thank you for the gift of today. Refresh me. Invite me to discover your presence in each person that I meet and every event that I encounter. Teach me when to speak and when to listen, when to ponder and when to share. In moments of challenge and decision, attune my heart to the whisperings of your wisdom. As I undertake ordinary and unnoticed tasks. Gift me with simple joy. 
When my day goes well, may I rejoice. When it grows difficult, surprise me with new possibilities. When life is overwhelming, call me to Sabbath moments to restore your peace and harmony. May my living today reveal your goodness. Amen. Thank you for listening Ministry of Life Prayers. Do not forget to share this prayer with the ones you love. May God bless you all.